pretty cheap and like reliable and usually pretty healthy. Are you sure about that? No. We got the dung katsu with the special sauce. This is the final meal update. So I just came back from the cafeteria of getting breakfast and I decided not to eat in the cafeteria today. Instead, I wanted to have breakfast in the office where I work so that way it'll save me time. So I didn't get much for breakfast because there, there weren't a lot of options that I saw that I liked or um, so what I got was this. this dream here and this. Donut thing in my drinker bottle. I'm not sure what it is, but let's get it. I thought it was gonna taste like a donut, but this tastes more like it tastes like a Twinkie that was fried. The Twinkie was left out for a little bit. So breakfast. I'm gonna give it four out of 10 stars. Not bad though, especially for only 165 calories. Hello, we are here at the IGC campus cafeteria. As you can see here, it's all shared by three. Sorry, you're gonna have to cut that. <laughs> Hello, we are here at the ancient. We are at the Incheon Global Campus cafeteria that is shared by multiple universities like the University of Utah, Ghent University, and also Mason. We heard that the lunches and the dinner and the breakfast here are really good, so we want to see if that's true. Let's go ahead and go inside. We are finally inside of the cafeteria. Here, now, you have several choices. Chef's choice, you have regular Korean choice, and you also have ramen as a choice. We love to see it. So before we get our lunch, we have to choose what ticket we actually want. So today, I am going to be choosing both the Korean and the special chef meal. Let's go ahead and buy our meal ticket. <laughs> So here we have the special chef meal. We have the regular Korean meal. So let's go ahead and redeem these coupons. Okay, let's go to chef special. Okay, so we are getting the first meal. It was at this moment that he knew. Okay, so they told us we can get some soup with the special chef meal. Isn't this amazing? Now, you can't forget your side dishes, of course. We got the kimchi. You can never go wrong with kimchi. Don't forget, when you take a picture, what do you say? Kimchi! This is our first meal. Okay. So now let's go ahead and go get that final meal. I think we passed it. Oh, people. We're getting, we're getting, yeah, yeah, yeah. Korean meal. I wonder what today it is. I want all the food that is. I don't know what I'm saying. Haha. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so again, spoon. Yeah, don't forget the rice. Oh, this is seaweed soup. 
Okay. Usually, people normally eat this on days, but I guess today it's my birthday. Can't do it anymore. Okay. This is, I believe, fish cake. The seaweed soup, rice, some udang, fish cake, some pokebi, and we have some special kimchi. And we have our special chef's meal. You got a. We got the dunkatsu with the special sauce, with a side of french fries, salad, and of course, you can never go wrong with some rice and side dishes as well. As you guys can see, there are these really interesting looking dividers that are separating multiple parts of the table. These dividers are meant to separate people and prevent others from getting corona. <laughs> Food. Okay. Yes. Delicious. It's a little bit sour, but I think that's because of the pineapple thing. For the chef special, eight out of ten. Awesome. So let's get into this Korean meal right here. I'm gonna take a little bit of rice and then I'm gonna soak it in. I am under the water. Seeds. Please help. This is perfect for the non existent diet that I always tell myself I'm going to go on. <laughs> so it tastes like the, the fish cake was braised in soy sauce. I give it 8.5 out of 10 stars. It's really good. Now it's time for us to return this tray back. Let's go, let's go, let's go. So first you want to return your utensils. Our food waste goes in here. Here, okay. Bye-bye. When you're a little thirsty, you can go ahead and get some water from this water fountain thingamajigabai. No plastic cups, save the planet. <laughs> So we want to see what other people think about food here at the cafeteria. Hello, oh, my name is Jung Bin Yu, and we're eating ramen right now, and it's very delicious. Eight, eight, yeah. Uh, I'm eating ramen right now. It was good, yes, and I'll give eight out of ten. Hello, I'm also eating ramen. I'll give like eight out of ten also. Me too. How would you rate the cafeteria here? Six or seven points. Okay, six or seven points? Yep. Okay, thank you guys. Okay, thank you. As you guys can see, the cafeteria is not that bad. Okay, awesome, so what do you think about the food here at the cafeteria? Um, it's pretty good. It's not like, it's amazing, but it's pretty cheap and like reliable and usually pretty healthy. Are you sure about that? No. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Hello, and we are back and it is 526. So that means it is Dinner time! So let's go ahead and get some dinner today. So, there is only one meal for dinner today, so we're gonna choose. Of course, your gloves again. Wonderful camera person. 
Kaya is going to be eating it for me. But other than that, we are going to enjoy this now. Let's get right into it. Very good. Is it? Yes. Mm. It tastes like water. This tastes like just water. Mm. I don't know the name, but it's pork something. Soy sauce, pork. Because a half star, that means like it's not a star. And it's just a star. So let's dig into this. Let's start with the tofu and what is it called? into this tofu and something to eat it with some rice. I'm getting it everywhere. I think it's seasoned very perfectly. There's not a lot of salt, but it's really crumbly and it just breaks up. I give it three out of five iFest stars. That's kind of spicy. It's kind of dry, but it still tastes good. Mmm, mm, good. When you mix the, I really think it's good. Something with the tofu mix. It's really good. So I'm going to finish this off camera and I will see you guys next time. Until then. This video was brought to you by Incheon Free Economic Zone, a city that welcomes you and welcomes all.